Yes, Joyce K. Nas, Canada. Yes, Muheshimiwa. Karibu, karibu, karibu sana mchambei tiji. Asante sana. Yes, leo tuambie history yako. Ah, oh, okay. Habari yenu waheshimiwa wa Kenya wenzangu. I hope mko poa, pia mimi niko poa. At least by now tushajuana, mmenijua. Nimezoea kukuja kama Joyce Kainas Canada about Canada immigration. Uh, but I believe hiyo sasa tumeshika shika na kama hujashika Canada immigration, please unifuate kwa uh, YouTube channel Joyce Kainas Canada ama kwa Instagram kama uko na message ni Joyce K Canada. So ama kwa YouTube ni Joyce Canada. Guys, leo nimeingia kama Joyce K Canada content creator sababu uh, tumeanza kuelimisha watu vile wanaezaenda ma countries zingine sio Canada peke yake because we have learned that kuna countries zenye watu wanaweza saidika. Kuna countries zenye watu wanaweza saidika mnaweza enda kusoma for free. European countries, most of them, unaweza enda kusoma for free. Zingine zinahitaji usome language yao. Others, they don't require you to study their language. So leo, tutaanza na Finland. There are 44 countries. 44 countries in the Europe. So tutaenda through all of them. So today is our first day. Nataka kuafundisha mjue how at least you can apply to go and study in those 44 countries. Kama uko na swali, please utanifuata kwa hii channel ya YouTube inaitwa Joyce K Canada Content Creator. Why nimeamua kukuja kuongelelea about hizi countries? Because nimekuwa hapa kwa mutembei over time. Nimekuwa na mutembei for the last one year, nikikuja hapa kwa channel yake, kuongea tu Canada, 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 Canada. And most of you are telling me that Joyce, Canada is expensive. Joyce, kukuja Canada inakuwa ngumu. So tutaftie nchi zingine zenye tunaeza kuja kama immigrants. So that's how I ended up kuataftia European countries. Na sasa iko kwa my tips. Niko hapa ni waeleze. Kitu ya kwanza nataka tuanze because I know the majority of the people that are following on this channel. I, I have been reading your questions. So I know majority of you munaeza taka sana vocational colleges. Ama munaeza taka free tuition fee. So that's why that's what I was looking for. Kazile nilikuwa nafanya hizi researches, nilikuwa natafuta. First of all, shule zenye ama country zenye zitaweza kuchukua watu for free. And the other thing, nilikuwa natafuta kama ni colleges, kuenda colleges, colleges zenye zitakuwa for free. Na colleges zenye zitafundisha watu skills, crafts, kazi za mikono. Hii na include kama mechanics. Watu wenye wanataka kuenda kusomea mechanics. Munajua hizi colleges ziko Kenya zinaitangwa polytechnics. Sasa hizi vocational colleges are like polytechnics. Na ziko European countries. Leo tutaanza na Finland. Most of you must have heard about Finland. Uh, so kuna vocational colleges kama mechanics, fitters, kuna machef ama cook. Unaweza enda hata kusomea agriculture, business management, fabric design, plumber, Kazi ya construction, kazi za massage therapist, hizo, hizo zinaitangwa skills. Kazi yata za kuendesha hizi heavy machinery, kama ma truck drivers. Hizo kazi, why I want us first of all to go to Europe to study is because ziko in demand hapa Canada. Hapa Canada ukitaka kukuja, because mina ishingi Canada, ukitaka kukuja Canada at the trades, hizo kazi ziko mingi. But sometimes, amuna training, sometimes... Uh, mkotuna skills but hamuna training so hiyo ina, ina kulimit wakipata mtu mwingine mwenye amesomea hizi vocational trainings from european countries wanamchukua first before wakuchukua we mwenye huna skills na pia wanaangalia kwenye umesomea hizi skills so kama unaweza chukua hii opportunity kwanza uende finland usomee hizi vocational colleges ama polytechnics sitatumia jina polytechnics because hiyo polytechnic ni jina ya wa Kenya Nitatumia jina vocational colleges. So, kuna vocational colleges tatu, no nne, zenye nataka kuwapatia. Na nimeziandika vizuri on my YouTube channel, hii enye inaitua Joyce K Canada Content Creator. But I'm going to mention them here, but you may not get the spelling. So, for you to get good spelling, utaenda pale kwa channel yangu na utazipata. So, ya kwanza inaitua Vamia College. Vamia College, hakuna 
Vamia College has no tuition fee at all. It's free of charge. Mshawa is kia shule zenye za international students zenye ziko free. Me too, I was shocked until I had to do research, research, research. Initially, the first time I heard about this, I, I, used, I used to host um, uh, what we are, Wakenya when you are Germany. And they were telling me that Joyce Kukuja Germany is for free. Then I was asking them, what are you talking about? Because coming to study in Canada, one year pekeake, one year tuition fee in Canada is up to from 15,000 Canadian to 20,000 Canadian. That's like 2 million Kenya shillings. But his Shula Munaskia, they are for free. Who doesn't want things for free? If you go to study in these colleges that are community colleges, colleges is a government, atakama wewe siyo wa iyo country, utasoma for free. Now, what are the requirements? In Mesema, one of the colleges, kuna Vamia College, kuna Lapland, USC, and then uh, UAS, and then kuna um, Business College, na kuna USOA College, USOA College, those four colleges, Ziko, Finland. Now, these are for vocational colleges. Uh, requirements, kuna kitu moja tu ya najua mutakuwa discouraged. But kama umekuwa ukinifuata for, for Canada in migration, munasikianga nikisema kuna English tests. Hizi colleges, mbili zake zinahitaji English college, hii vamia enye ikotushon fee na Lapland, but the other two, they don't need you to, to, to pass in English. Awangali your test in English. But let me just talk about it so that Kama wawo umefanya iyo IELTS, IELTS inafanyangwa British Council, kopale Upper Hill, ama Westlands, um, it's called what, URC, yeah, in Westlands, that's where I did my English test before I came to Canada. So you, all you need to do ni hiyo English test, ama ingine inaitangwa Duolingo. Ukipita iyo IELTS, na kama unataka kujua how to pass IELTS, kwa video zangu, ukitaip tu YouTube, Joyce Kainas Canada IELTS, ni I-E-L-T-S. Utaona how to prepare for that test. Upit upate tu a band of four. That's enough. Utaenda kwa hiyo website yenye nime provide kwa channel zangu. U click, u apply, u upload hiyo English tests. U istume kwa college. That's all. They'll give you an acceptance letter. And from there, uta apply for your visa. So what is the other requirement? Uh, application is for free. Free application. Why Munajua Canada? One college to apply in Canada is a hundred dollars, a hundred to one fifty dollars. One college alone. So these ones are free application. Okay. So tuition fee, kama huta pata iyo enye ko free, kuna two colleges in Mwambi Utalipa. But how much are you paying? Guys, unalipa <laughs> unalipa eighty euros. Eighty euros ni kama ni kama ni kama kupawa for free. So unalipa between 80 euros to 280 euros, depending na college yenye, unasoma paia. On top of that, wanakulipa, kuna mshahara watakuwa nakulipa, because ukienda hizo vocational colleges. Kama ni plumbing, mchana, mtakuwa na part of the time yenye mtaenda theory, kuna part ingine mtakuwa mnaenda kupractice. So mkienda kupractice, they will be paying you, even as you are a student. I remember when I was an a student, my first college, we used to get paid in Kenya. I think that time the Kenyan government was very, the economy was very strong. We used to earn 2,000 Kenya shillings per month, and I was a student. Those days it was a lot of money. I was a student and we used to get paid 2,000. They used to tell us that's for your own uh, upkeep. Maybe una buy pads, ama una buy mafuta kitu kama yo, but they used to give us food, and now to show fit we go to Nalipa. Anyway, now that's why I'm telling you it is possible for a college to be paying you when you're studying. So easy college zinakulipa around 1000 1, US uh, 1000 euros to 1050 euros per month. So hiyo pesa utatumia kulipa accommodation na kununua food. Now the other thing you may need to know ni ati hakuna age limit. Finland haina age limit. Kama wewe uko na 18 years and above because some of you are not going to be able to do 50 years, you will qualify for easy vocational colleges. Yes, you will qualify. Kwanza kama wewe uko na experience kidogo, kama wewe uko kwa plumber, sijui kama Kenya, hizo, hizo organizations na kuanga registered. Especially kama unaweza wa proofia that umekua plumber, umekua electrician, umekua kwa construction, and you, are, you belong to a certain board of, board of those organizations. Kama umezi register in Kenya. It will be very good for you. 
utaonyesha tu hiyo ukuja na hiyo barua ya kusema that we uko member wa wa hiyo nini wa touch wa upload pamoja na na english test then the other thing uh, is that you don't need to learn their language okay you you kwanza unaenda kusoma na english but ukifika huko of course uta learn their language with time hakuna age limit ndio maana nasema admission in happen between two admissions wako na admission ya january na ingine ya august that's why i have decided to start with this one because ya january hii mwaka imeisha because haizi tuko april so ya january hii mwaka imeisha but we have august so between now and august unaweza kuwa umefanya hiyo english u test hiyo english na uende uchale ufanye admission ya august so be ready it's january and august uh, finland wanataka waka sana sana hizi ma countries nataka waka so especially after covid okay uh, then after that tunaweza jiuliza then nikimaliza ku graduate what will happen after you finish after you finish your course uta apply to become a permanent resident for you to become a permanent resident now that time you'll be required to speak in their language which is fin so that time you'll have to test a, a, a to test a, an exam ya kuonyesha na unaweza ongea hiyo language yao na walipe around 7000 euros to apply for pr pr is like becoming a permanent resident and then after becoming a permanent resident utaka an, utaka 5 years before you can become a citizen but even if you don't want to become a citizen when you have got education from finland coming to canada will be very easy if you ever want to come but if you don't want to come it is still good enough to stay there then when you're there i was also learning doing my research in kaona that ukitafuta jobs are part time are teaching english if you can teach english those jobs they pay so well even as a student to a student to after part time ya ku teach those jobs pay so well okay Ah uh, now what do you need for you to do the application ya hii shule? Nimesema kama uko na hiyo barua ya kuonyesha na you belong to a board of plumbers, a board of electricians, you kama Kenyans na registiwa hizo construction, fashion designers, hizo trades. Kama umeregistiwa uko ama uh, uko kwa hiyo board kuwa na barua ya kusema you are part of that. Then kuwa na hiyo English, something else, they need proof of funds. Kama unaweza pesa kwa kwa your account that is like five Kenya shillings is like half a million 500,000 inaitangwa blocked account hiyo pesa unaiweka kwa blocked account kuonyesha na that uja uja unaweza jiweza as in huja dwere meto you know <laughs> you understand so hiyo pesa unaiweka in a locked account kuonyesha na that you can afford but you uh, the locked account will be in finland so hiyo pesa utakuwa unatolewa kidogo kidogo every month for one year that is one major requirement but if if you can prove that uko kenya ulikuwa na salary ya less than 50000 kenya shillings less than that every month you don't need proof of funds so you just need to utoa a bank statement for the last 6 months waambie mimi Kenya nilikuwa ngana job yenye nilikuwa nalipwa less than 50000 then that time they will not ask you for proof of funds then uh, employment letter ile job yenye ulikuwa unafanya huko Kenya you will need a letter to show that ulikuwa ngana job so that uonyesha na uko na skills na pay slips pia kama huna hiyo pesa yenye nimesema ya proof of funds you can look for a sponsor from Kenya but huyo sponsor asikue abroad. Usitafute sitako mwenye ko Canada ama US ama ko outside Kenya. No, it has to be a local sponsor. Either your parents, your brothers or somebody. Na andike barua na aweke. If you follow my video on YouTube utailawa better. Then ulipe flight reservation, that one is a ticket. Ulipe ticket you can even book without having to pay literally. There's a way unaweza fanya uh, travel itinerary watu wa, wenye wanafanya anga travel travel watu wenye wako na hizo travel bookings Kenya wanajua kukutengenezea travel itinerary without paying so that waonyeshe ume book ku travel and then uyeke pamoja u attach and then uh, I said about proof of uh, yeah all that visa inatoka anga within 2 weeks Iyo visa yenye uta apply nimesema intake itakuwa August na January kama ni August visa u expect itatoka within 2 weeks so maybe you can apply in July around there ki apply July itatoka in 2 weeks 
Uh -huh. That's all. That's all. That's all about Finland. So unless you have a question, I can take a few questions because I only had 20 minutes today. I can take a few questions and then and then to one. To me talk about Libya, Italy with Joyce na wakawaka sasa tumefika mutembe. Yes, we are doing well. Benjamin, ni mentala ile ile maswa mwenye tunafundishwa na wakawaka on Joyce K content creator. Lazima ifiki hapa kwa mutembe so that wa Kenya to do how to immigrate. How do I get cheap labor? What are the cheap labors as I go back to school in Canada? Um, are you in Canada, Beliver, Mutahi? How do I, yeah, if you have a question for Canada, drop it. How do I get cheap labor? Okay. If you're in Canada, cheap labor is coming sana. But you didn't say whether you're in Canada. Uh, here to follow this resourceful. In, yeah, good. Thank you so much, Real, generally. Thank you. I'm interested, how can I apply? I did a diploma in automotive. Yes, it, automotive engineering is one of them. It's one of the courses in Itakusaidia Kuingia is of vocational colleges in Europe. So follow my video on uh, Joyce K content creator channel, Utayapata. So fantastic, thank you so much. Pin inbox. Uh, inbox, what do you mean? Inbox, enda uniandikia kwa YouTube. Comment za YouTube hizo ndizo raisi sana. Nisaidia na yako, na namba yako. Fatma, kwanza nataka uelewe so that by the time you talk to me, umeelewa hii program. Because if I have to share my number, you can imagine how many people I'll share my number with. And I don't even know you. Can you work as you study? Uh, yes, you. I said, ata watakuwa nakulipa. They'll be paying you as you study. 1,000 euros every month. Atakuwa wanakulipa, that's what I said. They'll be paying you, so usijali mambo ya pesa. Nataka unyini wate muende muangadie hiyo video. Iko kwa Joyce K Content Creator, kwa, cha, kwa YouTube. Joyce Visitor inachukua simungapi toke ya Canada. Ya Canada size wamesema, I think ni 200 days. Ime reduce, imekuwa better squeeze. For Canada, I hope you're asking for Canada. So let me see another question. Iko kazi ya polisi uko. Apana, bravo. Polisi hakuna nchi enye itakufanya polisi unless you are a resident. Maybe you change. But unajua polisi wanakuanga wamesoma a lot of uh, kama watu wa NYS. By the way, guys who have been to NYS, this, this is for you. Those things that you did in NYS, please use them to immigrate to Europe. Unaesa fanya kazi ukiwa na hiyo vocational college. Yes! Utafanya kazi. Why not? You will work. Na unalipua around 1,000 euros. Iyo ni kitu kama 100,000 Kenya shillings. 100,000 Kenya shillings. And more because exchange rate inategemea. Truck drivers Canada. Heavy, heavy truck drivers. Uh, Nikona video ya truck drivers wa Canada. You can check. Yes, there is. I have done a degree in pharmacy but I need to do the vocational. Yes, kama ukona kitu ingine enye haiko related na na vocation, or you can still do as long as we have transcript the pharmacy. Check those four colleges and you may find your videos following what of business administration. Business administration is one of the vocational courses, by the way. That's what I learned. I didn't know. But they're saying that business administration, uh, business management, they're calling it business management, is a vocational course. So, yes, you can do it in Finland. What about printing? Yes, printing is one of them. Very good is among them. Joyce, I've been in construction for some time. I want to apply in diploma in civil. Yes, construction is one of the one of the vocational courses. Where is the school here in Kenya? Ahiko Kenya. Tunasema atutaki watu anataka kusomea Kenya. Sayi tunataka kupeleka watu maju wakasome uko. So wachana na Kenya. Kenya tutarudi tukiwa na kakitu. Tukuja to develop Kenya yetu. Sindi ya wase. Need caregiver work. Caregiver work in Canada. Fuata video yangu ya caregiver in Canada. Remember European countries kuna, kuna caregiver jobs. Huh? Kuna caregiver jobs. Remember that. Go check my video nye nimefanya na Beth Modoni YouTube channel ya Germany. Wanaitangwa Opea. By the way, Beth Modoni is a, is a recruiter. She's an agency. So look for my video. Utapata email yake hapo. I want to immigrate to Canada. Canada, follow me on JSK Canada channels. Three of them. 
Hi, Janet. I'm not Janet. I'm Joyce. Helen Michaludi doesn't respond to emails. I did a Zoom meeting with her, but since... Uh -huh. Yeah, she has frustrated a lot of my followers, so I no longer work with her. Sorry for that. Unfortunately, people have become very bad. Uh, do you need any pre-qualification before you get admitted to the... No, nothing else, apart from IELTS. Ni English too. Na siyo college zote zinahitaji IELTS. That's what I'm saying. Angalia zain, some don't need IELTS. So check. How many hours one will work per day? Uh, uh, I said you're working 20 hours per week, but in those 20, 20 hours per week, in a month, wana kupatia 1,000 euros. Regardless, as long as you meet the 20 hours per week, they give you 1,000 US dollars. Uh, euros, sorry. How can I get driver job in Canada? You have to do truck drivers. Sasa wewe, si wende tu nini ufanya kwanza kazi training ya truck drivers, heavy machinery. Easy vocational courses zine tunasema sai. Can I get a job in Canada as I study for masters if I go there? Yes, Canada, come, come and study masters in Canada. It's very good. You'll, you'll get a lot of jobs. Are there firms and companies from Canada who travel to Kenya to look for workers? No, 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 no. If somebody tells you anakuleta Canada as a farm worker, ujua uyo ni conman. By the way, Kenyans, mkwe aware, there's, there are a lot of conmen when you want to work permit. Niza wongo. There's nobody who should give you a work permit. It's not any fake. Don't, don't pay, especially the ones that are asking you to pay. Musilipe, ni meona watu wengi sana wamekoniwa. Victor Anasema, what are the requirements for one to access Canadian visa? Canadian visa, if you want Canadian visa, nimefanya video mzuri sana on Joyce Kainas Canada channel. Kwa YouTube. Na uniangalie kwa YouTube. I have understood you deeply. Thank you, Aman. You are following. Asante sana. Thank you so much. Please, Madam Author, I am from NYS. Wow. Sasa wewe tunataka tukupeleke nini Finland. Ukafanya easy vocational courses. Please. Follow my videos on, on my channel, Joyce K, Canada Content Creator, kwa YouTube. And as I, if what? Nani free? They are free of charge. I came late. How do I apply to study in Finland? Online. They are online. Website ni mepeana kwa hiyo video nye iko kwa, kwa my channel. Why are they denying visitors visa in Canada even after lifting border restrictions? I think Canada... Canada wanakuwa wan overwhelmed. I think wanakuwa overwhelmed. Ama ni nini? Sijui shidao ni nini? But saizi tutawachezea gemzuri ya kuenda Europe. Kama watupati Canada, tutaenda Europe. Na Europe pia wakitukata siju tutaenda wapi. Ama ni Australia, ama ni UK. But UK saizi kumekua overcongested. UK tulifanya videos, tukafanya videos. Now going to UK is very hard. Going to UK has, even for caregivers, is very hard. So tutakuwa tunaenda na yenye iko on market. Uh, Niki apply visa so that I attend event, event huko. Will they give me? Oh, Canada. Yeah, I, 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 it's not guarantee. It's not guarantee, but you can try. Mi wana sema mtu wa jaribu tu. It's good to try. Thanks for your response. Thank you so much, Ada. I'm a social worker. Can I do in Canada? Yes, you can. You can. I'm a nurse currently doing BSN. Can I get a job in Canada? Yes. Carol, please fo follow my video on nurses. Nimefanya video tatu moja ya nurses to go to UK, another video for nurses to go to US, another video for nurses to go to Canada, and another one for nurses to go to Germany. So for nurses, I have got very good videos for them. Hi, Joyce, watching from Nairobi. What is the minimum qualifications? That's a very good question. Uh, minimum qualifications, I think za Kenya wanataka kutoka D. Kutoka, by the way, si lazima, niliona, ata wameandika wengine, si lazima ukue ata na yo D. As long as ukona skills. Kama umekua uki practice, ease of, easy vocational skills. Eh? Kama umekua plumber, electrician. As long as you can prove ukona hizo skills. Na ukona barua ya hiyo board. I'll find out kama Kenya wakona hizo board. Siko sure, but I'll find out. Next, next Saturday nita kuja kuongelele about uh, Austria. Next Saturday we'll talk about Austria. Nita kuja na hiyo information. What about gym instructors? Yes, you can still do gym instructors. Economics, PhD scholarships, very many. 
Kwanza PhD munalipwa. You are getting a salary every month for you to study in Finland. So follow my video, please. I have done hospitality hotel. Can I have a job? Yes. Okay. Those are the jobs that they want. I say chef na cook. Angalia yo video ya Finland. In the legal jobs, why do you want to change from a lawyer? I can see you are a lawyer. You want to become a nurse from a lawyer. You want to mean that it's that serious. Caro. Caro. <laughs> eh, Caro, I would like to talk to you. Thanks for the response following. Thank you so much, Aman. Thank you so much. I have a diploma in power engineering, fully licensed in solar and electrical. Can I get a job in Canada for an for vocational training that can now allow me to immigrate? Now, Canada has got a very good vocational college. They are called here Polytechnic. There's a video I did about Saskatchewan, Saskatchewan College or Saskatchewan Polytechnic. It's in a province called Saskatchewan. But do you know how much they're asking? Tuition fee, when I will is a 10,000 Canadian dollars per year. That's like to send me 1 million Kenya shillings to come to a polytechnic in Saskatchewan in Canada. Do you have 1 million <laughs> to come for a vocation or college? If you have, well and good. If you don't have, Kusong and Finland. Wow, Joyce, you look good. Thank you, Princess Kate. Asante sana ni grace ya God. Approximately how much would it cost for the entire process of application to Finland to final admission to the vocational institutions? Um, I said uh, application fee is free. Come on, apply if I'm your college. Application is free and there's no tuition fee. So it's zero. It's actually zero. <laughs> it's zero. Maybe. Maybe Pesaya IELTS because if Vamia College wanna hit the IELTS, Vamia College they need IELTS. IELTS size in the around twenty eight thousand Kenya shillings, British Council. By the time I had started doing my, I was starting, I was starting doing my videos on my channels. Uh, British Council will wanna IELTS fifteen thousand. Within one year, or my pandisha size in twenty eight thousand. <laughs> Wameona watu wanaenda, watu wanafanya hizo IELTS. Sasa wamepandisha bei. Hawataki nini kujua kama kuna economy mbaya. Hi Joyce, I'm an IT technician and I also want to further my education as a work. Uh, Charles, do you want to come to Canada? Canada IT, I have a program for a new one, brand new. Hata ijamaliza one week. Uh, iko, iko Saskatchewan. That province of Saskatchewan. IT. And nani jobs, by the way. Iyo si kusoma. Those are jobs. IT people come to Saskatchewan, I'm, a, I'm a Ontario, I'm a Alberta, I'm a British Columbia. We have got four provinces in Quebec, four provinces in Zinataka IT. So check my videos for IT. Some IT programs, you don't need the license to work. But some like uh, computer tech, computer engineering, uh, software engineering and another one. Those ones they need license, but all the others, like ten others, web web designers, they don't need licenses. You just need a job. That's all. Joyce, who will help us because we rely on your content. Any other lawyers so far? Oh, kujia ni kupatia lawyer mzuri. Acha na na wiyo ni fake. Ebu send me an email. Send me an email. But the lawyer I can give you is only for PR. See wa kukuleta kama visit. Atakuwa idea to PR. How much do I need in terms of expenses, tickets, and residence permit? Do I need to study work in Finland? It's free. It's free, my my dear Joe. I can be any free. I can expenses. Expenses when I could one thousand euros euros every month. How can I connect with you personally? Kwanza nataka wa apply ni ukona passport. Najo angiri na semanga I want to connect with you personally. Muki kutana na kambi ajo is a passport sina. Sasa unamuuliza na kwa nini ulikuwa unataka kukutana na mimi personally na hata hujaanza Can I migrate to Canada and do my PhD there? Yes, you can do your PhD in Canada. Why not? I have a diploma in civil engineering and I would like to explore various opportunities out there. How can I go about it? The first step is to check my YouTube channels. I've got three of them. Moja ni ya Canada peke yake, hiyo inaitangwa Joyce Kainas. Hiyo ingine sikuizi naongea Europe. Naitwa Joyce K Content Creator. 
And then if you want to come and study in Canada, you'll find Joyce K study abroad. Those three, YouTube, Peke Ake, you'll find me. First of all, watch my videos, understand, and then you ask me questions. How can I apply for scholarships? I've, I've, written, I've done a lot of videos for scholarships for Canada. Please send out check. Hi, Joy, sorry I came late. I'm an ask KRCHN, but Jafanya Ayat. KRCHN, when you are in Kenya, why in the UK, haraka haraka, in four months, you'll be in UK. KRCHN, with here too, with that, KRCHN. Follow my video for UK. You will go to UK in four months. If you can wait for one year, you will go to US. Kuna agents when you are in the US. If you want to come to Canada, it will take you like two years. So it's your choice. Check my videos for nurses. But come on, Mimi, why na eza kimbia UK kwanza ni kulange nye iku available. UK, bio sana. What about te dental technology job? Unajue sasa mambo za dental zinahitaji license. I don't know much about that, but you need the license. Just can I do IELTS online? Um... Yes, you can do Duolingo. There is Duolingo and there is IELTS. But Duolingo si mzuri sana sababu ita kulimit countries. Kama Canada uta tumia yo Duolingo. But ukifanya IELTS and you want to go to Finland, the same IELTS uta itumia Canada if you ever want to come. As long as ijamaliza two years. So, ayen, 31 minutes. Tumemaliza. Sikuwa naona kama ita waisha. <laughs> Hi, I would also love to further my studies through through right now, I'm pursuing high diploma. Smith, go check my videos. Europe. Watu wakuja na maswali Saturday. Please go read ahead of me. Hata mimi ni kusoma ni nasoma. I am doing research. Hata wewe wenda usome ahead of me about Austria. Check my video for Austria. Then Saturday tukutane hapa. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. So tumalizi hapa. Naona maswali ziku hapa mingi. Ebu wa ambia wakaangalia my videos. So that... Okay guys. Guys. Ukiangali hapa chini unawana... Uh, subscribe to Joy's channel under the name Joy's K Nas Joy's K Canada Content Creator. Yeah. So you can end up with a many of that content at least in the Utahaza Kujua is my sorry mingi m now is up a mingi zime give you up and the zero the kuanazo satan to put an apa kyungia mamba Austria na sasa uli the elements on it on a could give you up for videos. Otherwise Sijui kama uko na the last remarks and ningetaka kuambia tukimalizie. Mimi nataka kuambia siku hizi kuna opportunities mingi sana not like before. Unajua kitambo hakuna hakuwa mtu wako anajua hata kama kuna country inaitwa Austria. People are used to know Australia. So guys, me me I just want you guys to follow these things, mfuate and then do something. Don't just follow. Start somewhere, especially zenye ziko free. The free programs, please do something. Do something for yourselves. Nikubaya, economy inaenda kukrash. Nataka mkimbishane na ayo. Yeah, kama kama hapa Kenya, Kenya economy yetu ni haribika, iliisha, ni malozi. Hey, mkimbishane na inauation. All right guys, bye bye. <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay. And good night good people. Um paka mpaka saa 3 tukutane tena enjoy za tawajibu maswali mengi.